Welcome back to The Daily Love, everyone. I'm Ashley Turner, yoga instructor and body-mind psychotherapist. So last week's topic was on help and asking for help, tuning into where you could really ask for a little more support in your life. And this week is the exact opposite. and We're heading up towards Thanksgiving. So this is a season of abundance where we really celebrate the harvest in our lives and the overflow. And so this week I want you to identify one person in your life that could really use your help. What do you know is maybe one of your own expertises or something that you have a particular talent or skill at? Um, choose someone in your life that could use a little support, a little uplift, and help them out spontaneously without them asking. Just really show up in patience and identify one place that you can go out of your way this week to reach out and help someone else. Um, our arms are an extension of the heart chakra. The heart chakra is the only chakra that actually extends horizontally. Everything else is vertically, but the heart is the symbol of a hug, of coming together, of reaching out, that our work in the world is a symbol and it comes directly from our heart, how we offer ourselves in the world, how we offer our work in the world. So choose someone that you know. Um, maybe it's a single mom that could use some babysitting or you could use some alone time. Um, maybe it's a parent that could use a little help understanding technology and really getting a little more skillful on the computer or on the, on the um, cell phone. And maybe it's someone at your work that you could reach out and mentor a little bit. But choose someone that you could help out. And again, it's spontaneous, um, totally unsolicited, and without, you know, need for recognition, but just helping someone from the abundance and the overflow of who you are and what you have to offer. Enjoy, um, go out there and share a little spontaneous act of kindness, and let us know how this feeds your heart. Of course, the more that we give, the more that we get. So when you're giving like this, you're really pumping up and feeding and flexing the muscle of your own heart. So enjoy giving. And one, one important key, it's not just buying something for someone else, but actually doing something for someone else. So it's really an act of kindness. Do that. Let us know how it works for you. Send us your questions for next week, facebook.com slash Ashley Turner Yoga. Have a wonderful, wonderful week. Take care.